<laughs> Hello, Pongo. Oh. Oh. Um. There's another one. So I thought I'd do another quick video on how to reinstall the Mondeo battery now that it's fully charged. I'm going to do a little test on the multimeter. See where that's at. How you doing? How you doing? Say hello. Say hello. Say hello. Um. Oh, another one. Oh, where are you going? So here's our engine bay, nice and dry. We had a lot of rain last night. Um. Still got our bits and pieces up there. So before we connect it, we'll grab the multimeter and see what that's saying. Set it to 20 volts, put it somewhere. Red's positive, black to negative and we're getting 13.10 volts so we know that's enough to start a car right so just got to reconnect the terminals I'll reconnect the terminals to the posts rather get the terminology right Nice and tight on there. And there's our positive. Now, unfortunately, I suspect this will not start the car because I think there's a fuel pump problem or something else going on that's not the battery, but we'll see. And even before I test it, I'm still going to reconnect the air uh, air filter because if it's not going to work, I'm just going to leave it in there and disconnect it. For now. See what it does in a couple of days. If it holds its charge, then we know it's a good battery. So if I scrap the car, I can keep the battery. Ah, we forgot to put our little safety bracket on. And that's an eight, eight millimeter. There used to be a hole 
For that to go on, and that to go on. What's happened to that? Oh, must just go like that. So with the air filter, you want to kind of slot this thing down the front. Try and find the feet. This thing's just super in the way. What a poor design, Ford. Don't forget to replace your sensor. Oh, I see. I put I put this on upside down. There we go. Okay, let's see if it starts. Oh, it's a shame, really. This car's the cleanest it's ever been. Look at it, look at it, look at it. So clean. There's a bit of dog hair, but I did my best. Wait for that glow. You see the headlights are stuck on? Why, I don't know. Okay, so uh, yeah, I guess that's a glow plug relay, a fuel pump, fuse relay, or the fuel pump itself, which is on top of the gas tank, which means you've got to take the gas tank off to get to it, which is like a 300 quid job, and I don't have any axle stands to do it myself. So maybe this is just getting sold for parts. We'll see. I'll let you know. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and like. Give the video a thumbs up. So I'm just going to disconnect the battery. No point having it connected while it's not running.
So if you like the video, leave a comment, like, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, ring that bell, all that good stuff. We love it. If you've got any idea what's going on with the car, please leave a comment. Give me an idea where to start. Bye.